Welcome to Beginner Yoga Lesson 1. Today will be a simple 15-minute exercise that you can easily fit into your daily routine. Extend both arms overhead, then bring them to prayer for three deep controlled breaths. Remember throughout this exercise to follow the breath inhaling into one movement and exhaling into the next. Inhale both arms overhead. Then exhale and swan dive all the way down to a forward bend. Take one more deep breath in, then exhale up to flat back, inhaling your arms back overhead. Now extending the right arm out, looking up into the eye of the elbow, go in for that side stretch Bringing both arms back overhead and extending the left arm. Once again, looking into the eye of the elbow. Bring both arms back overhead and return to prayer. Inhale both arms overhead. Exhale, swan diving down into a forward bend. Place the palm of the left hand on the floor directly underneath your face. Then twist and extend the right arm straight in the air. Now place the palm of the right hand directly under your face and twist and extend the left arm straight into the air. Come back into flat back, then inhale, swan dive up, extending both arms overhead exhaling to prayer. Inhale both arms up once again, then exhale, swan diving down into another forward bend. Come up into flat back, then placing both hands on either side of the feet, extending the left leg back first, come to plank, and then up into upward dog. Then down and back into downward dog. Let's separate the feet and bending one knee and straightening the other. Go back and forth at your own pace for a couple quick stretches. Now bringing the feet back together, jump them in between the hands, back up into flat back and inhaling both arms overhead, exhaling to prayer. Inhale up once more, then exhale, swan diving down into a forward bend, both hands on either side of the feet. Extend the right leg back, then the left this time. Into plank and up into upward dog. And down and back into downward dog. And we're going to extend the right leg straight into the air. And bring it up in between both hands. Take the heel of the left leg flat so that the heel of the right foot is in line with the arch of the left foot and come up into warrior one. Then extending into warrior two and back into warrior three. 
looking up into the eye of the elbow. Return back to warrior two, palms up. And swing that arm up back into warrior one. And come down back into runner's pose. Pull that leg back. Now you're in plank. And then back up into upward dog. And back to downward dog. Now extending the left leg, straight in the air. Swing it through, placing the heel of the right foot down, and come up into warrior one. Extend out into warrior two. Back into reverse warrior. And then back to warrior two, palms up. And swing your arm up, back into warrior one. And bring it down, point the heel off the ground. And once again in runner's pose, bringing that leg back to plank and then up into upward dog. And down and back into downward dog. and jump both feet in between the hands, coming up into flat back, and back down into a forward bend. Now inhale both arms up, swan dive, arms overhead. And then exhale to prayer. Deep breath. And then inhale, both arms overhead, swan diving back down to a forward bend. Up into flat back. Now palms on either side of the feet, jump back into plank, and then upward dog. Then down and back into downward dog. Remembering to follow the breath in between each motion. Now extending the right leg up, swing it through, and keeping the heel up this time, let's go into a deep runner stretch, placing the elbows on the ground, and going as low as we can. Now back into runner's pose, and keeping the heel up, bring the arms straight overhead, into a high lunge or crescent pose. And bring the arms back down on either side of the foot and bringing that right foot back into plank. Up into upward dog and down and back into downward dog. Swing that left leg straight in the air. And then swing it through into runner's pose. And then elbows on the ground, come down into a deep runner's stretch. Now back up to runner's pose. Swing both arms straight in the air for crescent pose. Bring both arms back down, you're in runner's pose, bringing the leg back into plank, and then up into upward dog. Now come down and back into downward dog. Jump both feet in between the hands 
and come up into flat back. Now with one fluid motion, bringing the butt down and the hands up, we go into chair pose and holding chair pose. Focusing on the breath. Exhaling down into a forward bend. And inhaling, swan diving both arms overhead. And exhale back to prayer. Now we're going to do one simple balance posture. Bringing the heel of the right foot into the left thigh. Extend both arms straight overhead and breathe. Controlling the motion out of these postures, exhale the hands down to prayer, bringing the heel to the floor, and bringing the left heel into the right thigh, extending the arms overhead for another tree pose. Exhale back to prayer, bringing that foot back down to the ground, control it, and inhale both arms overhead, coming back down for another forward bend. Up to flat back, and now let's sit down and we'll do some floor stretches. Bringing the heel of the right foot in. Extend straight out over that left heel for a nice hamstring stretch. Remembering to breathe. Focus on the breath. And switching legs, bringing the heel of the left foot in to the right thigh, extending over that right heel, and breathe. Extending both legs out and extending over both heels for a double hamstring stretch. All right, coming out of that, we're going to go into cobbler pose. So bring the bottoms of your feet together and grabbing the arches of your feet. Stretch forward with your back straight. Now arch the back and extend all the way out, hands on the floor. and reach. And breathe. Congratulations. Now come into a comfortable seated cross-legged position. 
bringing your hands to prayer and enjoy a few nice deep breaths. As you relax into the completion of Yoga One.